Yeah, that was Peter Nemeth off his album Believe eight self-written tracks and every single song on the album has a story um, and it's all about life events and what it is that, uh, that is involved in it now Peter uh, it's uh, I've got uh, Peter Nemeth live in the studio with me today and um, uh, I'm quite pleased to be able to have you here Thanks, As uh, I I cannot believe how well written this album is and how great a job you've done to it. Now, just uh, like the song I just played, Hey You. Mm -hmm. um, now, I know these stories are of your life, but you can explain to the listeners out there what yep. what it is exactly all about. Yep, thank, thank you, Andrew, sir. Um, the, the, I wrote the album mostly because um, personally I... I have chronic post-traumatic stress disorder. Yep. Um, I've been diagnosed with bipolar and depression, and I found it hard to communicate with people, and especially with children. Yep. And um, one of the ways that I thought I could, I wanted to leave something behind for my kids and something to encourage them and encourage people, and so I, I put, I wrote these songs. Um, and that song you just played Hey You in particular was yeah. a song I wrote for people who suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder yeah. and depression because yeah. um, I, I personally know what it's like and, yeah. and I just want to try and help any way I can. That's one of the reasons why I got you, I got you in here today was because of that because it's such a relevant subject mm -hmm. uh, at, at the moment. It's such uh, something that is not widely publicised in a lot of places. Sometimes people have a tendency to hide it yep. rather than uh, seek help. Yep. Uh, your album, I think, resolves that issue. It, it's, um, you've done, as I said, you've written every song yourself. So these are all about self-felt experiences. That's correct. Yep. And to be able to do that and put that to words and then put music to it, yeah. You've done a great job. Yeah, thank, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, no, I really appreciate your kind words. Uh, uh, it, it's, yeah, we, I, I love uh, being able to get local artists in and getting yeah. people in to talk about their music. Your music uh, hits spots to people that are suffering the illnesses that you're talking about. Yep. And we, we go back and we look at... Uh, like um, Vietnam veterans exactly. and also some of the veterans from Iraq and from, yep. uh, um, from uh, um, Afghanistan. Yep. And the same thing happens. This particular album, if you sit down and listen, would be relevant to them because it's exactly yep. what they're, they're sort of thinking. Exactly. And post-traumatic uh, um, stress disorder, I've... Um, being an interstate truck driver for myself for so many years, yep. um, and I've uh, I've had mates that have had pretty serious accidents and have ended up with, and it's a debilitating disease. It is. It is very debil very very debilitating. And it sort of puts you into a hole, and that's where a lot of it reverts back to the black dog, um, mm -hmm. and we all know about that. Yeah. And I, with you and some of these songs that you've written. Now my two, as I said, I've got my two favourites on here today. The uh, first one was Hey You and the one I'm going to play after the interview, Hiding Places. Mm -hmm. And that, yep. if I've never heard a song ever in my life, that's exactly yep. what we're talking about right now. Yeah, no, that, that's <laughs> awesome. Like, I, I can honestly say, um, I, like, the illnesses it caused me to pretty much isolate myself yeah. and and just stay in, in my isolation and not come out into the community, not express myself, not seek help. Um, I just would hide away drinking, smoking, taking yeah, drugs, yeah, yeah. Doing, doing whatever. That's that's always um, a, 
alcohol, cigarettes and or whatever, and drugs and all that, that's always an avenue of release. Exactly. The, um, uh, the, the strength that you show mm -hmm. by coming out that other side and developing this music, bringing yourself into the forefront, putting yourself out in the public, and bringing this music to people's lives yep. is the best, best therapy you could ever ask for. It is, and, and I'm still on my journey, so I'm still not yeah. perfect, I'm no. not, and I never will be. You know what I mean? <laughs> and I don't I never claim to be. Mate, you're pretty uh, humble too, believe me. Uh, I'm I'm getting better. I'm I'm a lot better than I was. <laughs> that way, so. um, the. Uh, there's a couple of the fires still alive. Is another uh, another yeah. particularly good track. When you write these songs, mm -hmm. it seems um, when you sort of you must have a, a massive memory recall to be able to uh, put all your um, experiences onto paper and then put music to it and then write that song, put lyrics to it and. And this is uh, tantamount to your talent. That's as I said before. It's a testament because yeah. your talent's there. Thank Keep you, nurturing it, mate. Don't ever ever lose it because Thank you very much. you're uh, you've got a beautiful gift. Thank Keep you. going. Keep going. Use it. Use it as your therapy. Thank you very because much. Because it's brilliant. Um, Th that particular song, um, "The Fire Still Alive," when I when I actually wrote that and I first started playing it, um, I started playing, I was in a very dark but place at that yeah. time, and I just started playing some chords, and I just started singing, and that's what came out of me, and I was just in tears, and, and I was actually crying for about half an hour, just singing it over and over again, in, in ball of tears, just to get it into me. So It's could, full of feeling, um, uh, Peter, it's full of feeling. Yeah. Um, you can envisage, when you hear the song, um, you, you sort of envisage the pain yep. and, and, and the uh, the scrambling of the brain yep. that you're going through when you when you've done those songs, and you uh, you haven't got it out in record stores or anything else like that. It's all available at your website, which is uh, uh, PeterNemethMusic.com. That's correct. And uh, yeah, well, good memory. Yeah, that's good memory. And. Also, you're available on Facebook too, of course, but uh, definitely go to uh, the website, www.peternemethmusic.com and purchase his music there. It's also available on iTunes. And uh, look, you know, we, we've seen uh, a lot of good things. You, uh, you happen to turn up at the uh, Rural Aid Appeal mm -hmm. uh, a fortnight ago on the Saturday and... Uh, put uh, 20 albums out there for us to sell. Yeah, it was a great cause, so I had to, had to support it. Could, Mate, could well, you knocked us out of the ballpark with your offer. Well, the good thing was, you lived, I lived right across the road, so I only had to, <laughs> I only had to, walk, I only had to walk across the road, so that was great. Oh, that was good. Yeah. Um, it, it was a great effort out there. We yeah. had a wonderful day, $2,000 raised uh, yeah. for rural aid, and uh, you got to mingle with a few of the uh, people over there, Yeah. and uh, that was great. You're... Uh, this was, of course, was uh, uh, was made by Robin Mackay at uh, Pacific International Music. That's right, and I'm um, sorry, buddy. And I, I just re I was actually able to donate some of them extra CDs to the cause for the rural suicide mm. aid yeah. because Rob, um, in his goodness and the kindness of his heart, he yeah. actually um, put in a bit of extra money for yeah. me towards the CDs. Yeah. Um, so I actually got quite a few for free um, <laughs> from Rob's help. Yeah. So thank, thanks very much, Rob, Rob McKay. Yeah, uh, he's a great bloke. He really yeah. is. I know he's involved with uh, Phoebe J um, too and... Uh, she did a marvellous job at the event, and um, but you're, uh, you know, it, it, it's funny, you know. I look at you here, and um, you're you're proud of what you've done, yes. and you've got full reason to be proud of what you've done. It's uh, some of the uh, some of the music there, of course, is going to touch people's hearts in different ways. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to do. Thank you, sir. And, uh, it's a wonderful, it's great for, for having you here in the in the studio. I really appreciate yeah, it, mate. My, because my uh, honour. <laughs> uh, you're um, 
Are you doing any local gigs around the place or are you trying to stay shy away from it at this stage? Um, I've, I have been shying away from it at this stage. I haven't wanted to go into the pubs and the clubs mm. and play only because um, I've had alcohol problems in the past. Yep. Um, I still drink occasionally. I don't. I still drink. I don't drink heavily. Yep. I still have a couple. Yep. N- n- nearly each night I have a couple drinks to, yep. to help me sleep. But um, I, I, I'm, I'm, I have this fear that if I start going to the pubs that I could all of a sudden be yeah, drinking over heavily. Over the yeah, you know. Yeah. Well, that's um, a fair enough reason. Man. Yeah. But I'm really keen for great causes such as the rural suicide yep. cause and, yep. and any any sort of cause that um, festivals or yep. anything like that that promotes good causes I'm, I'm happy for I'm, I'm not here to try and be <laughs> someone I'm not you know? well that's great mate well look we're going to fold it up there mm-hmm. uh, but what I'll do is I'm going to go out uh, with this song I'll keep uh, plugging this um, throughout the uh, the thank afternoon you. thank you sir um, I, I do appreciate you coming in and uh, being here because as I said you're local yeah. um, it's a great album yeah, uh, thank something you. that I think everyone would be proud to have in their library because something different. And yeah. thank you very much for the music, mate. Thank you know, you're welcome, sir. Yeah. I, really, I really made it for, for me children. It's something that um, once I pass on, I can leave behind. They can turn it on and have a listen and yeah. hear Dad's voice, you know what I mean, and hopefully help them through their hard times. Well, that's times. a good thing for them, isn't it, to hear Dad's yeah. voice? Well, they're going to go through hard times as well. I yeah. think everyone in life goes through hard times. Exactly. It doesn't yeah. matter who you are. No. You know, the, the best celebrities in the world, they're, they're suffering just as oh, yeah. much as the Vietnam veterans yeah. and... So as my neighbours and all around, I look around the community everywhere. I see people are suffering yeah. from from depression yeah. and bipolar and anxiety and stress. And um, well, this so. one particular song that I'm going to be playing now. Have a very good listen to this, uh, people, because this is something um, I think we can all sort of not relate to in some ways, but we can rel- uh, You know, you, you can sort of understand. Song and this is uh, Peter Nemeth with Hiding Places. Peter, thank you very much for coming into Fraser Coast. You're welcome, thank we you. We do Andrew. appreciate it, mate. Thank you, sir. And here we go Hiding Places, Peter Nemeth. Here you go, mate. No, thank you, mate. You're a gentleman. <laughs> You're all right, mate. Not a problem. Really, Not a problem. Really appreciate it, mate. Uh, that, that